the Lord of the Night! Yeah, that's right. You caught Enjo for us, remember? But he ended up being completely useless. It's not a fair trade if you lost out. Ah, uh, that's on him. It's not your fault he's useless. Besides, we're friends now. You don't know us anything! Friends? <laughs> but your friendship is an even more valuable gift. I can't in good conscience accept it for free. So, promise me. If you need anything in the future, you'll come to me. For you, I'll do anything. Okay, let's take turns shouting his name! Uh-huh. Uh, do I need to do this too? Hyman's going first! Ahem. <clears throat> Um, nothing's happening. Hmm, let me try again. Shoo! Uh, that's weird. Does he not want to hang out with us? Wait, so let me get this straight. Some guy with special powers promised you both that you just need to shout his name and he'll show up? Um... Well, not both, actually. Just one of us. Oh, right. Well, you should be the one to try it, then. Paimon clearly just doesn't want to feel left out. Mm -hmm. Okay, then. You called? Whoa! He actually came! You spoke my name, did you not? When I make you a promise, I will honor it. Blink of an eye and poof! He's there! That's how you know he's an Adeptus. An Adeptus? Oh, uh, Xiao, was it? Hi there! It was me who asked the Traveler to call you here. My name's Xiangling. I'm a chef. I've made it into the finals of this year's Masterful Chefs, and I'm testing some dishes out in preparation. I'm trying to get feedback from customers with all different tastes. Customers. And that includes me? Uh-huh. The Traveler says you prefer mild food. Just the kind of person I'm looking for. If you don't mind, I'd like you to try the dishes I've made and tell me your thoughts. <sighs> Since it's you... I will do it. 